So you're looking at the EG4 12,000 XP and the EG4 12 KPV, but which one is actually the best for your solar setup? One is a high-powered off-grid beast, while the other is a hybrid workhorse that can send power back to the grid. But which one should you buy? Let's break it down. No fluff, just facts. Before we get into the key differences that could make or break your decision. Let's cover the basics. Both of these inverters are 48 volt split phase systems, handling up to 12,000 watts of power. But that's where the similarities end. The first key difference, off-grid versus hybrid. The EG4 12000 XP is strictly off-grid, meaning it's designed for remote solar systems and battery backup setups. Okay. The EG4 12 KPV is a hybrid inverter capable of working off-grid or grid tied, allowing you to sell excess power back to the grid. Who's the winner? If you need a grid tied functionality, the 12 KPV is your choice. If you're 100% off-grid, the XP is built for that. The second key difference power output and parallel stacking. The EG4 12,000 XP, that's 12,000 watts of continuous output. You can parallel up to six units. That's a total of 72 kilowatts of total power. Wow. The EG4 12 KPV, 8,000 watts continuous output, but can parallel up to 10 units. That's 80 kilowatts of total power. Who's the winner here? The XP has a higher single unit output, 12 kilowatts versus 8 kilowatts, but 12 KPV can parallel more units for a higher total system capacity. The third key difference, solar input capacity. The EG4 12,000 XP handles 24 kilowatts of solar input with two MPPTs, each capable of 35 amps. The EG4 12 KPV handles 12 kilowatts of solar input with two MPPTs, each capable of 25 amps. The winner, the XP dominates here, handling double the solar power. All right, let's talk about battery performance because this is where things really get interesting. The fourth key difference, battery charge and discharge rates. The EG4 12,000 XP has 250 amps maximum charge and discharge. It's ideal for larger battery banks. About 400 amp hours plus is recommended. Now the EG4 12 KPV, 167 amps maximum charge and discharge. It works best with a 200 amp hour battery bank. The winner, the XP wins. With higher charge and discharge rates, meaning faster battery charging, with higher power draw potential, it wins. The fifth key difference, efficiency and performance. The EG4 12000 XP has a MPPT efficiency of 99%. PV to battery efficiency of 92.8%. A PV to loads efficiency of 93.8%. 5%. The EG4 12 KPV has a PV to grid efficiency of 97.5%, has a PV to battery efficiency of 99.9%, and a CEC weighted efficiency of 96.4%. Who's the winner? The 12 KPV is slightly more efficient overall, but the XP still holds its ground in off-grid setups. The final verdict. Which one should you get? All right, here's the bottom line. Go for the EG4 12,000 XP if you need a pure off-grid inverter with power output of 12 kilowatts versus eight kilowatts. If you want a higher solar input capacity, 24 kilowatts versus 12 kilowatts. If you require faster battery charging and a higher discharge rate, and if you need smart load management, we'll cover that in another video. 
So go for the EG4 12 kPV if you want a hybrid inverter, off-grid and grid-tied capable. If you prefer a 10-year warranty and a better durability. If you need more parallel expansion, meaning 10 units versus 6 units. So which one are you leaning towards? Drop a comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. And if this video helped you, hit the like button so many more people can see it. I'm dropping more solar guides and reviews every week, so make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. Thanks for watching, keep shining, and stay charged, and I'll catch you in the next one. Hey folks, want to save 50 on your next purchase at Signature Solar? It's super easy. Just click the coupon link right below in the description, do your shopping, and boom, $50 off at checkout. And while you're there, check out the other links we've got. These are affiliate links, which means they won't cost you a penny more, but they will help support the channel. So don't miss out. Grab the $50 savings today and check out the tools we trust down below.